but very, very much. Um, we have two very special people here who have served. We have Mr. Frank Chemitar and Mr. John Delia, Pearl Harbor survivors from that fateful day, December 7th, 1941. Give them a round of applause. These fine veterans are so precious to our country. They have a few things they'd like to present the, the commanding officer of Naval Air Station Oceana, Captain Jim Webb.
from our buddy Bill Lepp. Hello, Bill Lepp. Are you with me, my friend? Yes, sir, Rob. Hey, we got you, man. You're sounding and looking good. Looks like you're getting uh, into a high G turn for us right now. We're in a high G uh, one eight here. I gotta tell you, looking at that North American Texan and realizing that you've been doing this for 34 years, you are one of the experts in our business, buddy. Well, we try to be, and we're just here to put on a good show for all the folks here at NAF Oceania and Virginia Beach. Ah, uh, you gotta love it. Well, what's coming up next, Bill? history books you read, they said either 10 or 15 or maybe up as many as 22,000 Texas invariants have been built between 39 and 45. What's your number? I thought there was about 18,000 built, and uh, including the artists that the British and Canadians use. All right, well, it's a good number, and I figure that's going to work out. Okay, we're going to watch for the landing gear, all right? Here we go. All right, Bill Lett pulls up. Rolls the airplane, keep your eyes on the wheels, they just appeared, uh, uh, okay, and uh, I think from the folks uh, earlier, they know that you can raise the landing gear, or roll it, you lower it, you, uh, what did you do with it? I extended it. Yeah, extended the landing gear, that works for me. What's coming up next, Bill? Okay, we're going to slow this little gal down and see how slow we can go. All right, let's see it. Now, we'll call this the high alpha pass, right? Same thing the jets do, except we did it before the jets. They did, and you're doing it with way less thrust to weight ratio. Oh, yeah. Tell them, Hunty, you know, the Navy called these SNJs, and these things used to be everywhere on this airport. Boy, did they ever. Phenomenal airplane. Okay, now you're slowing it down. Call the speeds up for us, Bill. Okay, looks like I'm doing about 65 miles an hour, and my ground speed is 60. How much wind up here right now? Oh, crosswind. Gotcha. Well, you got it going plenty slow there. That looks really, really good, sir. Uh, tell you what, Bray, keep her going by. What's coming up after? You going to bring the gear up pretty quick here? Okay, let's pick and clean it back up a little bit. We're not going to clean it up all the way and uh, show the folks a dirty roll or a roll with the landing gear down. That's a little harder to do. Yep, uh, a little bit of aerodynamic dirt. Those gears and the wheel wells cause uh, a lot of drag, don't they? They certainly do. Bill Left going to set up for this dirty roll. And by dirty, he means aerodynamically right dirty. Right there, right there. <laughs> I don't think, if you had an afterburner, you'd be wanting to jump out of that airplane. Yeah, hey. <laughs> All right, watch as Bill comes in from the left. Landing gear still down. This is the aerodynamically dirty pass. He's going to roll the airplane all the way over. He's got to catch his speeds just right. Hey, Art, thanks. Ten on your side. Thanks for being with us, buddy. Coming back tomorrow? Then come up here for a couple seconds at some point. I'll interview you next time, Art. All right, from 10 on your side. Thanks, Art. Over he goes. Bill left in the dirty roll. Hey, Rob, did I put the gear down or up? <laughs> I would just say that since before you extended it, I will say maybe that you retracted at that time. Roger. <laughs> Roger, Roger. Ready for your clearance, Clarence? Okay, here we go. We're going to do something that D6 is not supposed to be able to do. We're going to haul this thing over and burn it and fly upside down and then do a roll from inverted to inverted. All right, now why is the Texan not supposed to roll up, be upside down? Well, it's a carburetor engine. This has to be adjusted just right for the work. That's why it's not a burn cycle. It's a roll. Ah, I gotcha. All right, 600 horsepower, 5,500 pounds. Bill Lepp rolls it over on its back into the inverted position. How's the view? And rolls it over from inverted to inverted. Ladies and gentlemen, how about a big round of applause for Bill Lepp? Make some noise so we can hear.
hear you in the cockpit. He can hear you. Applaud for Bill Left. You hear that, Bill? Yeah, I hear that. Sure can. And here we go. We're going to do a four-point roll. All right, four-point roll coming.